I'm Troy Kirby with MLT News with a quick look at the 2021 Washington State Legislative Session. In the Senate Labor, Commerce, and Tribal Affairs Committee, Senate Bill 5267 earned a public hearing. Sponsored by Senator Derek Stanford, the legislation would require state licensing certification for electrical work associated with flipping property. So ultimately, Senate Bill 5267 is a safety bill. On, on houses that are intended for, say, for resale within 24 months. These are the same standards that new constructions are is currently held to. So this is not only safety, but this creates a level playing field. And this would also create apprenticeship opportunities for the 02, 06 res, residential electricians and some 01 electricians. You know, when, when people do this work, do they not have to get a permit of some type in order to make these modifications? And then when they get that mit, that permit, are they not subject to uh, having inspections done? Whether they actually get the, the permits, you know, I can't really speak to. I think that's probably the domain of uh, labor and industries. But I would say sometimes the perm what you're saying could absolutely be happening. My question is, how do we deal with the situation, like Senator King said, where folks don't get a permit? They're, I mean, right now, a homeowner can do the work on their own home. It's completely legal, but they are required to get permits. This would say they can't do the work on their home. They have to hire a licensed electrician. But that just drives the cost up, which it seems to me makes it more likely that they will do it on their own without a permit, not less likely. It's our understanding that existing contractor registration and flipping laws establish a time period of 12 months. That said, we'd like to see the language amended from 24 to 12 months if possible to maintain consistency with existing contractor registration flipping laws. No, we already had existing contractor flipping laws, so we'll take a look at that. Thank you, Mary. Thank you for watching the Daily Legislative Report by MLT News, covering the 2021 legislative session.